Miguel, it's your host for it. Welcome back to Love of Games. We're playing a little bit of Supermarket Simulator today, so I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We're going to hop right back to it. Grind it a little bit, got some more proper licenses, stocked everything I could. So uh, we're level 81, and we are starting the day. We got toilet paper and paper towels over here, which I don't like. I'm gonna end up moving. I adjusted. I put the oils next to each other. Ketchup, mayo, ketchup, hot sauce, peanut butter, honey, chocolate spread. Noodles are still together. I want to put the chips together. I gotta figure out how I'm gonna do that. Sugars are together. Cereal. We got some open shells. Pet food still together. Moved over the beer. I put six packs of Zap Soda and Cola up here. Um, let's see, we got a bunch more cakes. I don't like them being here. They're gonna end up getting moved. Move the chocolate and candy over here, along with chocolate powder and toothpaste. Move the toilet paper. I'm gonna just make all this section alcohol. I just haven't done it yet. I want to move all the cleaning stuff over, the potatoes over. I made this the paper aisle. Three toilet papers, paper towels, the book section. What product am I selling with the... Oh, the... I know what it is. It's this one. Forgot to set the price of that. One head at a third cashier, or third, uh, fifth cashier thing. Really hoping that they buy out potatoes and stuff makes it easier to move. I'm going to do beer, 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 probably do two deals of wine, or it, it depends on what the last product license is. I think that one is at level 90, so in eight levels. Come in and stare. Once I... The last product license, I'm going to redo all the shelves, make it make sense, then redo the stock room, because the stock room does not make any sense right now. We have the toilet paper over here. I like to do toilet paper one side, cleaning on the other. Nice selling without a price. Those have a price, those have a price. Looks. Looks all have a price. One, two, three, four. Yeah, you're gonna have to wait a minute. That has a price. Freaks me out when you're saying. Why are you saying it's too expensive? It's way too expensive. Fine. Oh, it may have been the yogurt. I may have forgot to do the yogurt. Yeah, it had to have been the yogurt. That's the last minute thing. Oops. Fifty-three fifty.
So yeah, none of the shelves nor fridges or freezers are exactly how I want it. Neither is the back room. But we are working on it. Dude, you spent a lot of money. I feel like we're at Barnes and Noble now. Ooh. Book about a mother and a child and three beers. Uh, doing all right, guy. You got a lot. There should be no product selling without a price. I have to go look and figure out what else there is. We are swamped. When I go back and I'm editing this, I'm going to be like, uh oh, I looked at the product and I just never said it. Nine o'clock. Whatever I was selling without a price, it sold. Salad? I mean, three things of mayonnaise. You're going to temporarily close ours and see. Those are all right. The only thing I could think of was that, because that was like the only cold food. Sodas are good. Don't restock anything on these shelves. Chocolate spread. Yeah, you're good. New chips got a price. Sugar's got a price. Is it a cleaner? I 
I am legitly not seeing anything being sold without a price. I have no idea what that just was. It's so dark back here. And all the books look like they hold a price. Chocolate does literally go on line by line. Tell me that I'm selling something without setting a price and then not tell me what it is. I haven't done any new frozen food. I mean, all of these are looking good. Seeing a price on all of these. Like, legitly, I've not seen anything without a price set. Water. Got to set the price on the water. That sucks. Is that it? I mean, we're already checking. Might as well check everything. All of these are looking good. You can do bread and bread, so it wraps around the top, I guess. Did you just... I don't understand what you just did, buddy. I really need this section to open up so I can actually put more lights to see back here. Good for the day, my friends. Yes, we are. We had 103 customers and we lost 245,000. I'm doing it well. Isn't that doing well? I'll say we can just leave it as is. Not much of a difference. Can be a lot of stocking you gotta do. I, honestly, I do like that those back there. I'm trying to figure out. Nope. The sugar's fine. Do you need to figure out a product to put down there? I'd like to put the other chips here. I've got a bunch of empty shelves here. Honestly, would like to move the pet food back here when this is done. Cocoa powder and chocolate can go together.
That doesn't need to be on the top. That was quick. We got bleach, bleach. I like to move the soaps all one to one. Everything's all funky right now. So we got those out. Remove, remove. Send that back. I'm trying to get these cleared off. I want to move more food items here. And if I have enough room, I may move the chocolate over here. I have no idea where I stored the paper towels. Right here. This is what I mean. Like, I don't like the way I have this set up at all. But it is slowly coming together. These are good. I'd like to get rid of the little fridge, possibly. I don't see a need for it if I can move butter onto one, popped clotted cream onto another. I should be able to get rid of that little bridge and move everything down just slightly. I don't even know what we're going to have to... We may not even need all the fridges. Just depends on what comes up next. How are we on bread? Bread is fully stocked. Chips. I mean... Peanut butter is what we need. Pepper. needs to be stocked. The sodas can be stocked. Like if we don't need any more fridges, I could take this one out. I can consolidate that one over to here. Double up on the milk. I can sell big. What is going oh you're stocking. Alright, so the new cakes are running low. Watch some stock. Distracting, but fun.
They're going to be a hot minute doing what they do. Remove that from down there. That's looking better. That's looking better. Just trying to think of what would help us the best. Because by stocking alcohol that way we got more vodka out. Vodka is a huge sailor. To be able to put more of this out. We got our kegs. I would like to make this alcohol too if we have that much coming in. I'd like to move these down. Let's just see what we got. Those are looking good. That's bleach. New stuff that could come over here. They're fully sold out of. See, this is where it gets confusing because, like, trying to restock while also trying to keep up with demand. You got these guys over here playing fiddly links with each other. I mean, they are glitched out. I'm going to put you here. You here. You here. Temporary overstock. Remove, remove. I'm redoing my cleaning section. And everything is just too much of a pain, right? Actually, these should go down here. I want to be able to find stuff easily without even trying. Right, right.
hand soap. Let's set these over here instead. Oh, we could stock soap water. We've got three different soaps. Well, they are nice and broken. We could actually do some organizing. Temporarily up here. You can't do this when they're not broken because then they're going to kind of restock all the stuff you're doing. Boom. Get rid of that. Soap is now organized. That looks a lot better. I need to move the potatoes. I don't know where I'm going to. I like put up front. They are literally probably the most purchased item on here. I have them in the back of the store. Looky there. The cleaning aisle and alcohol aisle more organized than it was when we began. That worked out great. Still gotta get rid of this crap, but I may do bleach all the way across the top, who knows? What is it y'all are trying to even put on? Toilet paper. Toilet paper is not over here. Let's go to the menu. We're going to fix the broken people. We're going to continue. Now they should be able to go do their own thing. I would like to move this meat over there. What is this? Ground beef. Not even seeing ground beef. Beef is moved. I'd like to put all the yogurts together. Hummus. You down. Now all of our 
yogurts together. It's looking better. second aisle. This up. I'm not going to just get rid of it yet because we may end up repurposing it. But we don't need it out there. Why are you. I think it was getting stuck. There we go. I still would like to move the pet food too, but that is not as big of a hurry. This is all... But that's over here. So I could do a cake aisle. I would get rid of the cakes back here. I like that these are all full now. This side irks me because that one's not. So we're out of a lot of stuff. Honestly, it's not too, too bad. I move the chocolate over. May have less of a headache. Like it, it really bothers me when these are not stocked all the way. chocolate potatoes. They could finish restocking and I could buy everything that we need to sell. to beat them before they try to stalk this.
It just looks cleaner when all the food shelves are full. Then I could repurpose these back here as something else. stand-up freezer aisle would just help me out so much more right now. Really would. restocking those over there, but at least I got these. Right. Can't do anything else with those currently. No longer have candy sitting back in this aisle. This will be all food. Sugar I want to reorganize. Probably put mashed potatoes down there. I got something to put over there. Put mashed potatoes over there. They make more sense with the rice than they do with the pasta. Add water. That's looking good. Wish I could get rid of the pa toilet paper, paper towels. Milk's looking good. That fridge bothers the crap out of me. I'd like to move all the soda, the water into one. Soda, go, go. You gotta stay where it's at. Gets rid of one of the waters. White label one. Just so we have organization. Water, soda. May double up milk. I do go through a lot of milk. Why was this brought to the trash? My own guys are against me at times. Ah, oh, you stocked the other milk. You guys suck. We got five things of milk. 
not how I was trying to do it. It's still full of eggs. Well. Two flowers. A lot of this I don't care about selling out just yet. Just because I'm going to reorganize the shelves. So let's go ahead and uh, start the day. Everything's put away. We can't get put away. We're slowly organizing. I'd like to move these frozen items over. I'd like to... I don't even know if I can. There's no place for it. It irks me. Get the milk in first. Got the paper to wipe your butt in this aisle. I'd like to move these cleaning products down or invest in alcohol. Because people really buy alcohol. Frozen food honestly could be expanded if people do buy a put more chicken out. That animal food can be probably moved into the cleaning aisle. That will leave a bigger open area right here. Oh, it's coming together. Still not a hundred percent where I want it to be, but it is coming together. really want my fourth cashier. Make life easier. Demand the fifth one. Gotta keep an eye on this up here because I don't want them to stock it because I want to clear out the shelves. Food aisle looks good though. I'm excited to see what kind of updates they do on this game because if they put more products in it'll uh, be quite a bit more interesting plus they could expand the store further he said I'd like to see front-end versus back-end stalkers maybe more books some basic hardware stuff like most grocery stores have like light bulbs or batteries and stuff I 
an actual bakery items, like an actual cake versus a cake little cake treat. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I just saw a shelf. No, it wasn't there yet. I thought it was. Eleventeen dollars. Fifty-eight, fifty. Why are you buying all the individual beers? You coming to my cashier? No, you're not. Lady? Yes, you are. Doing, like I said, we're doing pretty good. Fifty two seventy five. Ah, good man. Why do you need that much bleach? Dang. Individual beers, I swear. Everyone's buying chicken and sushi, man. All of that sounds good. Almost nine o'clock. Almost time to call it for the night. I was hoping more of this would have sold out. I've noticed that as we have grown, we've gotten more into a managerial style versus having to do too much hands-on. Still like... Coming over here? Yes, you are. And that cocoa powder. I go over to hot chocolate myself. Chocolate milk. Nothing wrong with good chalky milk. My goodness, you're buying all of my books. Which, if any of y'all readers do care, I do actually have three published books on Amazon. I only sold a handful of them, but I am a published author.
Dude, a lot of customers tonight. We were like closed in game like over an hour ago. Customers, nine, ten, eleven. Gotta get that toothpaste and bleach. I did close it, right? No, I didn't. May make a second potato pile straight across because we go through so many potatoes. more potatoes. So, yeah, double potatoes, because they are definitely a top filler. There's some cakes over here. Hoping to empty this thing. <laughs> um, maybe we will see. Yeah, everything's so close to being done. Here we go. Why well, has nobody stocked it? What's out of that? Rearrange the store. Everybody walk the dinosaur. for these yet. Not look like it. But hey look, we moved all of our treats over here. We've got potatoes. We have one empty shell. We only have one empty shell. And not sure what I'll put there yet. Now I got two empty shelves. Reorganize the sugar. I like Suso Suso, but I don't know. It's looking good. 
animal stuff. Still would like to bring that over here. Out of most everything. Dog food should be on the bottom just because of how heavy it is. Then that's all good. That doesn't match the toothpaste, which sucks. I mean, I could do bleach all the way across. Still, so here I'm not going to do yet. Paste is moved, pet stuff is moved. Drop you for a second. Move that one. Y'all ain't restocking that. Bleach go in here. Bleach cannot. That cannot. Those can. And I'd like to, but those will not fit. Clear that out. You move bleach away, the other cleaner here. Big old bleach box. Just stock the bleach that I pull off the shelf. Out to go get the other bleach box. That's a detergent box. It shouldn't even be over here. I 
I can't tell. What is what? Is that green? It looks green. Out of the other bleach. So that brings any new alcohol to go there. That can't be moved. And out of two different bleaches. Can move these cascade of things. trying to pick those up. Wheat. So move those over shampoo and toothpaste. Put the bleach up there. I could move the cleaners over. That is coming together how I want. Cleaners are still not where I want. But that is in progress. I'd quickly just move the toothpaste because I didn't really think about it. It should be over here. Don't try to stock this just yet. I'm gonna see if I can do some movements. Uh, take all of this out. that cleaning products animal food just out of bleach I like to move those little things over too which are right here So we got everything needed. I don't know if we have any more cleaning products, but I know we're getting more alcohol eventually. This all just flows. 
is like potatoes. Eventually we're going to look back and be like, how did we have this store any other way? We're also going to be like, why are we out of stock of everything? We don't plan on restocking just yet. All right, so over a short amount of time, our food aisle is almost completely packed. Our refrigerated area is almost completely packed, besides this one and that. This shelf over here has stuff in it, so it's hard to see. Got some empty shelves. Could do more freezer stuff. Got some more empty shelves. We may buy more dog food and put dog food on top and on bottom. The people were buying that more than cat food. We need to fill out the alcohol. Plenty of alcohol to put out now. Everything looking good? Yeah, it's good. Let's see, we're out of wine, out of kegs. The only thing I don't like is that the beers, like the old beers, are not stored with the other alcohol. We will put 12 packs in the fridge. But it is coming together. Like, I actually feel like we could open the store and run like this. We are so desperately low on pasta. We are out of. Now it's going to be run a random day just to sell out of some of the stuff to reorganize the shelves. We are definitely low. Nice thing about being low the way we are is we can reorganize. The like bad thing is it's going to count against us and we're going to lose experience towards leveling up our store. All right, we've got a bunch of alcohol out now, a bunch of potatoes. Said I would like to do more chicken. We sell a lot of fries, but not enough that I feel like we need another fridge. We could use some more veggies. If we do another chicken one, we could do a veggie one. We sell out of veggies a lot. There's plenty for this guy to stock. We are not full up. Farm fresh butt nuggets. More cheese. Alright, well, I actually think we'll end up calling it an episode here. Let's see 
much we made today. We had 104 customers and made almost eight grand. Pasta, eggs, ketchup, parmesan. Our cheese changed dramatically. Uh. We'll keep it at four twenty five. All right. Like I said, we're going to call it an episode there. We're going to see what we can do on the next episode. So have a wonderful day. Peace and God bless. Like, comment, subscribe, share the video.